name's Gary Britland and today I'm at the, uh, the home of the Burroughs Industrial Revolution at Peelfall Farm and just behind me you can see this wonderful building uh, it was rebuilt recently by its owner all this side was all, all had to be rebuilt and just in this wing here uh, uh, Robert Peel was actually uh, doing calico printing uh, probably parsley peel uh, his name came from uh, doing a parsley pattern uh, his daughter gave him a parsley leaf and uh, he started with that pattern uh, the first peel that came here was William Peel in the 1600s and uh, he died in 1650 so that's how far this place goes back uh, then his son Robert Peel stayed here and then another William Peel at church where they had loads of factories and they did more calico printing uh, William Peel was born in 1745 died in 1790 he lived at Church Bank Church Bank House um, and the, the canal was made then so they could transport the, the goods on the canal later Edmund Peel uh, in 1748 he was born died in 1776 and then Jonathan Peel he was here uh, in 1752 he was born and they went to Accrington and Accrington House and had all the land in Accrington and he died in 1885 so the first Peel, first main Peel that we had was the first Baronet uh, he was the calico printer and he worked with uh, James R. Greaves James R. Greaves invented the spinning jenny just up the road at Stanley Post Office on Twistle Whereas Robert Peel, he was uh, he, he invented the carding machine uh, and the calico printing and uh, spinning jenny that was made in the 1776. And the Sir Robert Peel, the first baronet, who was born in 1750, died in 1830. And um, they were called. He started the police force off going uh, and coming. Uh, uh, enforcing laws and they were called Peelers, the first policeman or Bobby's Robert Peel that's where the name comes from uh, then the second Robert Peel he was the the, uh, the grandson of the first Robert Peel and uh, he was Prime Minister he was born in 1788 and died in 1850 and uh, he was Prime Minister in 1834 but unfortunately he was killed by falling off his horse uh, and he founded the Metropolitan Police Force and uh, so all this area was mainly to do with them and uh, Robert Parsley Peel was here in 1723 and died in 1795 he was a cotton mill owner and uh, he was the grandfather to the Prime Minister Sir Robert Peel um, he was a yeoman, a farmer, and then he, he started doing the parsley pattern, printing, calico printing, and then that became massive throughout this borough. Uh, they actually had to move out of the borough because people were rioting the mills and pulling down the mills. Uh, but uh, it was him and James Argus that started the spinning jenny, uh, but uh, the mills were rioting and destroyed. Uh, so Robert Parsley Peel, he was the big contributor to the calico printing in this area and in the height they had something like 24 mills they had that much wealth it was awesome and they still do have now their ancestors throughout the country and there's some in America and uh, they've been over here to visit and uh, their empire was massive and uh, so that's most uh, of the history of the Peels the family they have a huge family and uh, many descendants we still visit this place now but I'm just glad that somebody has rebuilt this historic place because at one time it was a, a, a heap of rubble uh, this side there's only this side left and they've rebuilt this whole side of the building 
and there it just looks absolutely wonderful and it's a historic place of Accrington and Ironbury. Uh, so uh, uh, thank you very much.